What's up everybody, this is Steven Robles, the Bearded Teacher, and today I'm gonna to show you my most used shortcut. It's a shortcut that sends my ETA, or my estimated time of arrival, in minutes, and it automatically texts it to my wife. And you can set it to automatically text to whatever contact you would like. To set this up, I'm gonna open the Shortcuts app on my iPhone. Hit the plus button to create a new shortcut. Hit the add action button, and then search for street address. You wanna choose that street address step. Now here is where you're gonna put the address to where you're getting your ETA to. So if you wanna send this every time you're headed home to your partner or significant other, you wanna put your home address in this spot. If you wanna do your work address and you can send a text to your boss or someone else at work, you can put your work address. You can also create multiple of these shortcuts, one for work and one for home. I actually have that. Once you've put in your address, hit the plus button, search for get travel time. Tap the get travel time step and that will automatically get driving directions from your current location of your phone to the street address you put up top. Tap the plus button again and search for the text field. It just says text like right there. And I like to add a little bit more than just the minutes. So I'm gonna put be home in, and then you'll see this option here to add the travel time from the step before it. And that's gonna add it in minutes. So the travel time will say how many minutes it's gonna take you to get home. After I put be home in that many minutes, I can hit done. I'm gonna hit the plus icon one more time, and then I'm gonna search for message. Here, I'm gonna do the send message command. You'll see it's gonna send the text from above, which is be home in however many minutes the ETA is. And then for recipients, I'm gonna tap on that, and here you can search for any contact in your address book. Now, if you want the shortcut to send automatically, expand this menu at the bottom, and uncheck the option to show when run. If you wanna leave that on, it'll give you an option to confirm to send the message. If you turn it off, it'll send the text automatically. Hit next. You can name the shortcut. I usually name mine Home ETA, or you can name it Work ETA, and then hit Done. Now, whenever you tap this shortcut, it'll find out how many minutes it is to home, populate a text, and you can send it right away. You can see I've done this a couple times just to make sure it works. A couple things you can do with that shortcut. You can program an NFC tag to automatically run that shortcut whenever it's scanned. You can learn more about NFC tags in my next video. And you can even put that shortcut on your Apple Watch if you have one, or on your home screen on your iPhone. To add that shortcut to your home screen like an app, tap the three dots on the shortcut, the three dots in the upper right, and then you'll see an add to home screen option. You can title it or change the icon, then just tap add, and you'll see that shortcut right there on your home screen that you can run just by tapping that button. You can even add shortcuts like this to your Apple Watch face as a complication. That's what I have on my Apple Watch, so when I get in the car, I just tap my watch and it automatically sends a text to my wife how many minutes I am from home. You can see that complication right there on my Apple Watch face. When I tap it, it asks me if I wanna run that shortcut. I can run it and it automatically pops up the text message to my wife with my ETA and I can just send it right from there. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have questions or a how-to video you'd like to see, leave me a comment below. Don't forget to like this video, hit the subscribe button for the Bearded Teacher YouTube channel, and hit that little bell icon. This way you'll get notified whenever I post a new how-to video. Thanks for joining me today. I'll catch you next time.